Hi, this is Doreen Pinkerton, and with reaching out, I just wanted to share a thought for the Christmas holiday season with you ladies. It's a time of rejoicing. It's a time to be glad. It's a time to give thanks to Jesus. It's a time to thank him for the beautiful world we live in, um, in nature and natural surroundings. It's a time to give him praise for our country. It's time to give him praise for um, our ability to help people at this season who are in need. It's a time to rejoice and be thankful for the power God gives us through his Holy Spirit. It's a time to be thankful for family and friends. It's a time to be glad. It's a time to be glad over many things. I'm sure you can think of many. It's a time to reflect. It's a time to think and thank the Lord for the people he's put in your life who've helped shape and mold you into who God created you to be. It's a time of deep searching, searching for truth, searching for a deeper walk with Jesus, a time to ask God to take us to another level in our understanding of his word. It's a time to become disciplined and give and make time for the things that matter for eternity. It's a time to be at peace with those around you. And it's a time to find understanding for the things you maybe don't understand and would like a clearer perspective on. It's a time to try new things, reach in new directions. It's a time to lead others. It's a time to be bold for Jesus. It's a time to spread the gospel and the good news of hope and the love that Jesus has for everyone. What he did, the price he paid by dying on the cross, and rising again. It's a time to be hopeful, to not give up on someone who created us when the world might look bleak. It's a time to be strong and to make choices you normally might not make. It's a time to be supportive of others and remember that you might have been where they were at one point in your life or you might need them again when you enter a place of need. It's a time to exercise empathy and compassion, to love mercy and give mercy. It's time to exercise grace and ask God for a double portion of patience. It's a time to give and to reflect on that giving um, and to realize the greatest joy comes when we give back. I hope you have a happy Sunday, and I just wanted to touch base. Um, haven't been on as much as I probably would have liked this season, but I'm hoping to see you a lot more the next. God bless you, and I'm praying for everybody today. Please pray for me as well, um, that God will strengthen us all through the holidays. And in Norwegian, we say, Gul